Hi Scorpio, this is Just with your July 2016 monthly reading. I hope you guys are enjoying the beginning part of your month so far. Let's get into your reading. Well guys, your tagline to this month is going to be, damn. I'm sorry to say, but that came to my mind and as, as I was looking over the cards and I was reading the energies. Uh, yeah, it's going to be a damn moment for some of my Scorpios out there. Now, I see that um, for some of you, um, I see that something from your past came back, but it almost came back at the wrong time, the wrong time. The wrong situation and the wrong time. Um, I feel like you were dealing with... They could, some of you could have been dealing with a situation or a person that you had a fallout with. Okay? Um, in your past, you was having some problems with um, a past situation. And <clears throat> although... <clears throat> excuse me. Although I feel that you guys are definitely feeling yourself in a way... Um, I definitely get some really good en energy from my Scorpios. There's been some victories, some successes moving forward in the situation um, for my Scorpios. Um, the challenge is, although you're going to get a victory, you're not going to get exactly what you want. Okay, um, so there's going to be some compromise that has to happen for some of my Scorpios. That is going to be a challenge. Also, my challenge, the challenges for other Scorpios is because you're getting what you want, because you're getting the accolades, because you're you're getting all of this attention. Okay, and you know you're feeling like a boss. May I add, some of you guys are really feeling yourself. You're taking on a fire energy. You're acting more like a Sagittarius Leo or Aries woman, and um man as well but maybe more on the sensitive side the reality is is that some of you are going to be challenged because you're taking on this fire energy you're getting what you want people seem to be drawn to you the challenge is going to be for you not to be so smug humble yourself so humbleness humility is going to be very much necessary for some of my scorpios out there because if you don't guys i do see that you know don't be too smug too quick, okay? Because I do see that there's going to be some poor decisions made. So humble yourself, okay? Get back to that energy where you were being very careful. Um, you definitely want to be careful with the decisions that you're making. Some of you um, are probably going to be feeling less judged by someone. For those of you that's been dealing with a fire sign, Sagittarius, Leo, or Aries person, I feel like um, there could have been friction in the past. Um, you, Neither one of you really seen each other in the best light. I feel like there was maybe getting past that overcoming a situation the challenge is going to be I feel for you guys to really possibly really a hundred percent get in a good place with this person it may still take time but there is going to be a situation where you're feeling less judge, judge, judged by this person or you're judging them less okay so that's also how the situation can play out now going back to my work sphere for my Scorpios uh, I see that for those of you that um, have a lot of great things coming your way you know, you may be starting a new job, but then you hear that there could be a delay in you being able to start this job. Some of you could be getting an offer and then turn around and find out that actually the job fell through and therefore you're not going to get the opportunity. Some of you just up and made a bad decision and missed out on an opportunity um, because of poor, poor decisions. I feel because a lot of you were feeling like, hey, everything is going fine. I don't need that job. I don't need to respond to these people. And because of it, now you've lost on, on a great opportunity um you really have okay um for some of my scorpios now i see that there's going to be a lot of restlessness especially for those scorpios that have missed on an opportunity and now um your fire is a little dampened if you will um i see that there could be so if there's any type of opportunities that come your way guys please respond to them stay on top of things uh st still be paranoid guys but not to a negative ex uh, extent but just you know have that healthy um paranoia that you guys seem to have that you be able to make sure that you cross your t's and dot your i's uh, respond to everything double check triple check your emails um if you're not hearing from people reach out to them i would say do not allow a situation to go unheard and unnoticed um fight for what you want and this time but be humble as you go along with the situation now i see that um 
external to you now you guys are very restless so i feel like a lot of you are going to be moving fast paced your mind is going to be racing um you're kind of going to want things to move 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 and go 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 um as far as external to you i feel like there's going to be a lot of people coming to you that have problems in their love life problems in their um their relationships their home issues is going to be having problems so where you guys i feel were having problems um and now things seem to have leveled off at least in your home sector and possibly in your everyday life personal life as well i see that external to you there may be some upsets in the home there may be some problems um external to you with people Going back to this new opportunity for those of you who have started a new job, got the job, you're starting new, okay? There may have been a delay of a situation or you're starting a new job and therefore you didn't even decide to say, hey, I don't even want this other job because now other opportunities are coming your way and you haven't been on top of your A game to make sure that you, that you, um, meet every opportunity, that you don't miss any opportunities with this new job that you're starting i feel that some of you can get into the job and find out that the house their house is not together okay you go there and things are all chaotic things are not structured there's no structure to the way that things are ran the business is ran the way things are happening so the home base and the work sphere if you will is disrupted it's not stable okay so be mindful of that and i feel like you guys are possibly wanting to leave but then you're scared to leave like i want to get out of here but now i can't because that other opportunity that i had or those other opportunities that i had now i can't even go to them you know because they falling through because i thought that this was going to be a sure shot okay and i feel like some of you are going to be scrambling by the end of the month trying to go back to the drawing board some of you are going to be scrambling trying to um um, trying to either find a job, get a job, um, knowing that this situation is absolutely not going to work for you. Uh, some of you are really going to be scrambling. And I feel be, that's going to be because this is going to be a lot of chaos at this job for some of my Scorpios. I'm so tired of giving you these readings and I'm speaking, I'm talking, um, what I'm saying about now is cards that has falling out um as i was shuffling that is not on uh, the screen but i'm tired of saying this to scorpio that every time we turn around something is happening out of the blue but there's going to be some type of chaos that's gonna happen out of the blue for some of you guys um i feel like you're gonna be able to avoid some chaos that could have possibly happened okay for others of you there's going to be chaos that just explodes out of the blue okay um i don't feel like you guys are going to be um directly involved some of you will but that's a very small percentage of you but you're definitely going to be a witness to the situation and because of it there's going to it's going to affect you this job situation they may be so unstable that they shut the job down that they you know they have to close down for some reason this is going to be some type of upset chaos some problems that happen that may destabilize you you know with this current situation and may have you having to go back to the drawing board to um you know get your wits about yourself but i do see that there is um a possibility of starting a new job so there is definitely an opportunity for you to go in a new direction there may be a de delay in you getting that breakthrough you getting that victory oh my goodness i i, I really don't want to have to tell you guys that i, I don't want to read this this is crazy um but there will be some gains that will come in okay um there will be some gains that comes in <sighs> I know you guys wish that you would have taken on that opportunity that came to you, that you made sure that every opportunity that was available to you, that you jumped on it, that you made sure that you were available for. Um, guys, in this month of July, I feel like for those of you that's looking for employment, again, do not miss one email. Call everyone back. Try to respond. Don't be don't be a nuisance obviously but just you know send your emails follow up emails with people um try not to miss any opportunities absolutely and um yeah um that's what i see for you on the career sphere now um and you may have to pay out some money okay you may have someone may tell you something out of the blue you don't want to hear and now you have to pay out some money and now you're scrambling okay because something in their life is upset and they need some type of help 
okay and you really want to just say no but you know that you can't you have to help this person and then you guys are going to have to find yourself going back to a situation um, and trying to help rectify a situation that is quite chaotic okay so now on the love front um well you see there is someone from your past yeah that relationship that one that's not that great that hasn't been that great that one um i see that um there is someone that could have come back home could have come back from vacation you yourself could have come back from vacation um feeling quite good about yourselves or some of you could just feel like you know what everything is okay in my relationship i'm kind of starting off new or we're, we're starting off new and everything is good okay um this could be with a fire sign so sagittarius leo or aries person um reality is that you're going to find about you're going to be finding out or you found out about something that you did not like and that challenges you so you are like first you were feeling great and like a peacock and everything was fine and then you get this news okay and then it's like wait a minute what and it destabilizes you and now you're like oh my goodness now you're stressing yourself out okay now you're a bit stressed about the situation because now you know that whatever proposal whatever circumstances that you guys were starting out with that you thought you know was solid now you're realizing that it's no longer solid that this thing is not solid and and there's upset in the home there's upset in the home okay um you're feeling destabilized your home life is um a bit destabilized or this person you're realizing that they're no longer stable you know this person could have lost their job that you're hearing that you you know you were you know in a relationship with someone you living with them and then you hear that they've lost their job and now you guys are like, okay, how are we going to make ends meet? What are we going to do? Maybe we've put money out or, you know, we've just spent a lot of our savings or whatever the circumstance is. And now it's like you guys are unable to move past this right now. Can't, you know, and you're wanting to leave the situation for some of you that is not that severe. Some of you that, you know, this, you just learned that this person could have been up to no good. And now you see the devalue in the relationship and you're really wanting to move on but i feel like for those of you that your partner perhaps lost their job um, or you have lost your job so now the home is a bit destabilized you desperately want to move to a better place you know you want to get away from this drama and this stress and you just want to move to a better place because this could have been happening for you guys for the past eight months or since august of last year like you know i've just i'm over it and um i do see that there is a trying to go back so um if this person this fire sign that um you've been dealing with if you guys break up for some reason um and you break up with the person and then you're starting to try to move forward i feel like this person will be trying to come back to you but i feel like when they come back it's going to be acting like a child once again you know for that person that you guys have dealt with this constant immaturity with um yeah it's, i feel like this person is going to be coming back and when they come back um for some of you, when they come back, you guys are going to be arguing. There's going to be this big blow up that kind of like just bow happens. Like the person comes, excuse me, the person comes back and pow. And you guys have this big explosive fallout. Please be careful that this does not become physical. Um, when I see certain cars together, it just tells me like an explosion. So be very careful. Um, I feel like... Um, eventually if you have like this fallout with this person then you guys are trying to work things out again okay because no one's really wanting and ready to cut things off so you're going to try to work things out and then try to give each other what they need from the relationship so i don't see that it's being it's going to be over for you guys you're definitely going to try to work a situation out for my couples that lives together and having financial difficulties and are going to try to perhaps um go to um get a loan or get some type of help it may be you may be in an environment or a situation where a lot of people are trying to get the same thing that you're trying to get okay and because you're in a hardship you know you're fastly fastly trying to get some type of aid and assistance but i do feel like there's going to be someone that is going to try to work with you although it may take some time before you get approval so whoever you're trying to look for this loan for get some type of financial assistance from i feel like someone's going to be there to work with you it just makes be maybe some time before you can actually see the money okay um to help 
your yourself yourselves out excuse me um you may be encountering a lot of people also that are just like woe is me external to you so if you're not in a relationship at all you're just single you're just working and you're like you know my love life is fine or i'm single and my work life actually is okay you know you might be encountering a lot of people that are having relationship problems and are complaining about their love life and oh when am i ever going to find love for myself you know or why is my home upset you know and these sort of things so um you may have to play counselor and i know i said that to you guys last week but I, I do feel that this is energy is still rolling over for the entire month that you may have to be a counselor to others particularly those that are um, have broken homes and are in um, difficult relationships at this time guys so that is what I see for my Scorpios I think you guys have the well let me see yeah I think you guys have the quickest reading um, but it's really straightforward so that is what I see. I, I hope that this no, does not apply to anyone, um, but it will be applying to several of you out there. And there will just be some, I hope it, if anything, it's going to be some delays in getting um, an offer. Okay. Um, this is going to be a delay before you can get the judgment that you're seeking rather than it just being an absolute no. Okay. So that is what I see for you guys. Um, thumbs up, comment below and subscribe because I will be back next week with another one. Take care, guys.